everyone, welcome to Splendid Knitting, uh, where today is the week leading up to the start of the school year, and I am getting a little stressed. Uh, but let's start out with my knitting stuff, because I made some progress on the Anchor Summer shirt. I think it looks really good, I can't wait to wear it, I hope it actually fits, but we'll find out, huh? Oh my goodness, I hope it fits. Watch it not fit though. I'm scared. Anyway, um, I've also been working on a pattern, a bag pattern from a video. It's free, just like a video tutorial that you can follow. Uh, you can see I did make a mistake and I covered it up with crochet. <laughs> so it's gonna look like, it's definitely gonna look like a handmade bag. And it's gonna have patches and stuff. I think I'm just gonna decorate it with patches and like embroidery so that this doesn't look out of place. But I think it'll look cool once it's done. I'm excited. And it's a good way to get rid of scrap yarn. And it's showing me new stitches. It's just, I like it very much and I can't wait. And then I have big stressful school things to get ready for. I'm probably getting some supplies today and I, tomorrow I have, um, I have to be at school tomorrow for like 13 hours, not, not at school the whole time. Anyways, I have a kickoff day for an exec team I'm a part of at school tomorrow. And it's going to be a long day and I'm going to have to talk in meetings. I'm kind of terrified, but we'll just see what happens. And I'll live. I'll be fine. So, I feel the pressure. <laughs> Pressure's on. Oh, I'm wearing my, um, my, my freestyle vest today, which I really like. The yarn is Barocco Mochi. I love this yarn. Anyway, um, guess I'm going to Staples now. The weather is representing my mood. I just feel nervous. I feel nervous. I feel nervous. I'm back from getting my back to school stuff. It's weird that going into grade 12, I'm not really, hmm, how do I say it? It doesn't feel the same because I guess it feels like, I don't know, I'm not as excited about this year and like the school supplies and going to class and all the things that I used to be able to romanticize so easily. Um, I'm just kind of like, I don't know what to expect and it feels like there's a bit of pressure to figure myself out this year and figure out what I want to do with my life. So, some pressure there. Uh, let's look at my school stuff. Pencils, of course. Uh, little sticky notes. Got some highlighter slash markers. A new folder. And some dividers. That's all I got. So I didn't go totally nuts this year. Um, other years I bought like two folders and all the works and stuff and an agenda and everything, I realized um, there are some things that I just don't use that are appealing at the beginning of the year, but then it's like, I haven't touched that in five months, like agendas. I just write it in my phone now. I don't know, I'm apprehensive about this year though. I have to wake up, I have to wake up early tomorrow. I have to wake up at like, 6.15. Oh, God. Okay. Can't wait. Ugh. Sorry, I am such a bummer. I'm gonna leave. <laughs> it's been 
about a week. Uh, it's been an exhausting week. And I'm very tired already. It's been a good week. It's been a tiring week. I haven't been knitting because nobody has the time. This is horrifying. Okay, finally this works. It has been about two months since I last recorded anything. So I'm really um, crushing the game. Um, last week I was sick, unfortunately. So <clears throat> I did get a lot of time to knit. And I finally finished the... <laughs> Anchor Summer shirt. Um, <clears throat> here she is. It's not blocked, so the hem is kind of sticking up. I'm going to block it today and see if that actually helps anything. But this is like a very successful knit, all things considered. Although it did take such a long time. I'm not used to using small needles, and then I also got really busy and didn't work on it. But she's done. <clears throat> um, I also have, I don't know if I showed this, it's a, like a market bag, very cute, I altered the pattern a little bit to have a drawstring, but I'll link the video I followed, and <clears throat> as for new endeavors, I just cast on some mittens today with some scrap yarn, so I'm using a purple and the scrap yarn from the sweater I have on. And I think it's gonna look very pretty. I'll show the pattern. I'm using this pattern, these mittens, from my saltwater knitting mitten book. So I'm really excited about these. I think knitting mittens is just so therapeutic, like watching, especially the ones with color work, like watching the pattern come together is like so satisfying, so. I'm excited. I realize this this vlog has been a bit all over the place because I started recording right before I left for Halifax. Oh no no, I started recording after I got back from Halifax. So this is late August, and it is today October twenty second. So I'm really on top of things. Anyway, let's block this.